All right, guys, we're gonna get a measurement, a weight, and then get her back in the water. Alright, what up guys? Hey, it's your boy Manny B here with the Skinny Water Boys. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. Excuse the wind noise, it is pretty freaking windy today. Uh, but however, I am big game hunting today. I'm only using big baits. Uh, and not like other, other people when they say big baits are using like a six inch lure. Now we got 10 inch glide swim bait. It is uh, made by Fish Everything. And it's called the Taxi, uh, yeah the Taxi. 10 inch swim bait, glides beautifully. I got it on this big, big reel. It's a Tranex 400, eight foot rod. And then I have the Citizen and a, another uh, Cinco, like a seven point something Cinco. Uh, those are just backup, but I really want to get bit on this because right now it's getting into the hotter days of the summer. It's still springtime. However, uh, some of these trout that can't survive uh, year round, like the little ones like this size, they will die off or just become, you know, easy meals for big bait big bass that are trying to get ready for the spawn or you know the water is a lot colder here so they I, I don't think they've spawned yet or they're getting ready to but we'll find out thank y'all so much for tuning in it's either gonna be one of those days where i catch them get on them or i get like one big one so we'll see but that's swim baiting for you guys so remember that remember that let's get on the water check it out guys went a little too overkill on the sunscreen on my legs so i'm using this on an eight foot dial rod uh, Tranix, Tranx, 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 whatever you want to call it. Four Hondo, 50 pound braid. Wish I had fluoro because I know it was something better with fluoro, but I put braid on here originally for the big haters and whatnot. There's some bass right there, finally. Nice little followers. Followers are coming out from under these dogs. Not very big, but hey. Followers a follower. The reason why I went with a trout because yes, there's trout in this area, but it's getting hot where some trout start to die off that can't that aren't like strong enough to survive so if you get something they're like hey that's an easy meal it's already dying it's going slow why not give it a quick punch and see if you can eat it you know what i mean guys there's right, another one right now i'm big game hunting 
may not get a lot of fish but if i do it's either gonna be really small or really big so <laughs> stick with me guys that looks like a bed Yep, right there. Oh! I just got nailed. I just got railed. So well, guys, I thought I was filming. I just lost like a freaking tank. Right over this deep submerged brush piles, it came up and just drilled the swim bait. Easily a seven, eight pound bass. Just drilled it. He's somewhere over here now. She's gone though. My drag was too tight. I can't believe I wasn't filming. They eat. Oh my gosh. Well, they didn't break the freaking I freaking hammered that rock some big boulders on this current break right here hey you never know might find a toad just holding down to them Big bass. Big, big bass. That's a big bass. followed 
be boiled on it. Oh my gosh. That was a big boil. Are you kidding me? <laughs> what I say guys is going to be big or really small. So far I've failed on the big part. Look at that. Aggressive small mouth for you. Alright guys, we're going to get a measurement, a weight, and then get her back in the water. 